men or women are tough, and so are their horses. The army still needs them in spite of mechanization. They've roamed the ranges of New South Wales for generations, and now the Stockman's Roundup is in full swing. The army wants remounts. The new recruits are branded on the hoof. It's as painless as it's practical. The remount is also inoculated against disease and is thoroughly examined by the vet. That blob means that he's passed fit for training. Broken in and thoroughly disciplined, life in the army now begins. They're in the dawn exercise line. Quite as good as the exercise is the food. A true blue trooper always looks after his horse first. Allotment tears, please note. Besides plenty of exercise and good food, the remount enjoys all the advantages of regular grooming. On parade. It's the first big day for the new young horses, and they're all on their toes as the troops move off. The men who ride are tough, seasoned horsemen who can spend long hours in the saddle without turning a hair. Over the sand hills that flank an Australian beach, the light horse step out on a practice manoeuvre. The terrain might be Libya or Palestine. The famous regiment have a grand fighting tradition to uphold, a sacred trust left to them by their fathers who won Jerusalem a quarter of a century ago. Today, any invader is welcome to meet them at the charge. Finally, meet the girl who certainly knows the road.